morning friends, it's Tracy from Nova Scotia Living. It's 8.32 in the morning, I just got back from my morning run. Got myself a Tim Hortons coffee and I got my son one too when he was at the bus stop. When I got home, I was driving behind that slow, uh, snow plow so, you know, they don't drive fast and not that I'd want to drive fast anyways with the icy roads but yeah. Anyways, I just drove up to him at the bus stop and handed him his coffee so that's that's real drive-through coffee, I guess. <laughs> so anyways, I'm going to finish my coffee. Maze uh, is still snoozing. And yeah, we're going to try to get some stuff done today because it's the last week of school for the rest of 2018. The girls went to school with, uh, I gave them each 10 bucks. Oh gosh, I have a sore back. Um, gave I gave them each 10 bucks today because that Christmas bazaar is at their school so people who donate items over the past month or so uh, the kids can go and buy presents for their family so I gave them each ten dollars with the list of all their siblings um, so they'll be able to get it and I know ten dollars doesn't sound like a lot but the presents are really really reasonably priced like they're like a quarter or 15 cents or 50 cents or something like that so yeah, they'll come home and um, they'll have their Christmas shopping done, which is very nice. They're very excited. I didn't get a chance to snap a picture of the girls this morning. Mal Misha wore a red dress with a red hood thing to make her look like Belle from The Enchanted Christmas. Beauty and the Beast Belle, you know who I mean. And Maziah wore a nice flowery dress with a little tiara. She wants to be the Sugar Plum Fairy. And Mally just wore a Christmas sweater because today's a theme day, like all this week is a theme theme each day. And it was Chris, Christmas char character day today, so I said, Mally, you can just be a Christmas caroler. So that's what she wore. <laughs> but yeah, so anyways, I'm going to have my coffee. I need to put some more wood in this fire. It's cold out today, but not super bitter cold, but it's supposed to be snowing off and on all day today. So yeah uh we're getting a little more of the white stuff so yeah i'll check back in a little bit i just want to sit and enjoy the sound of silence while i can uh because it's the first one since last week so <laughs> i'll be back well i straightened up a bit may's just got up he's about to have a bowl of cereal and he wanted to watch the power rangers christmas special so that's what he's gonna do all right, friends. Ooh, the lighting's bad. I've been resting most of the day because I hurt my back. I took some medication and had a little kink, and I'm up now, and the kids just got home from school, but they were all so excited about the Christmas bazaar. They were showing me all the presents. Most of them are wrapped, but just all the pretty packaging and paper. I told them to keep them up in their room till we get the Santa Claus tree up because... Um, the Littles and Evie and, you know, we'll try to all get into it, so... Uh, the ones that they didn't have wrapped, I said, I'll make sure I get some wrapping paper and they can wrap them. Um, I just need to get some more wrapping paper at the store. So, yeah. But Mally was so kind, she just made me a cough, my second coffee of the day. So I'm going to sit and enjoy this. I haven't really done much in the kitchen. I have done laundry. I'd get up every once in a while to rotate that, but I certainly haven't folded or anything. But uh, it's a bunch of blankets anyway, so they'll just go right back on beds. But I'll be back in a little while. All right, friends, it is 5 o'clock, and I'm going to go uh, just do a quick errand. I'm going to go there and come right back because I just want to rest and take it easy. Um, I don't want to push my body because then I'll just be paying for it. But these guys had supper. My husband picked up some chicken tenders because he was in town this afternoon. Yeah. I had a bowl of that cabbage and sausage that I made yesterday. And, yeah, so we're all good. So I'll check back in a little while. All right, friends, I know this is a real pop-in video, but it's uh, about 7 o'clock. My neighbor just called, and I'm going to go over there for a little visit. So it's dark out now, and uh, yeah, it's nice just to have a little time out. Yeah, it's misty, rainy out right now, but we're supposed to get quite a bit of snow tomorrow, so I don't know whether we'll, uh, there'll be school or not. We'll see. We'll see, but oh, it was snowing earlier today, but now it's rain now. It's one degrees. Hi. Good morning. 
<laughs> well, I'm back, friends. I had a really nice visit with my uh, neighbor, Saritha. I go over there every once in a while, and she she likes to talk, and I like to listen, and yeah, had a really, really good time. She called earlier because she said she had a little something for, for us, so not that I ever, you know, I would never expect that in the sense of I'm not waiting for presents or anything, but it was so nice to go over and just have a few minutes with her. Mally, will you answer the phone? Anyways, yeah, she gave us a card. I'm going to show you the card. I'll just see if this phone calls for me. Oh, just a minute, guys. <clears throat> All right, sorry about that, guys. That was my sister. Um, we're just making a plan for later this week, um, like to do a gingerbread house and decorate Papa's Christmas tree and at his house and stuff after school. So that's exciting. We did that last year. It was a lot of fun. But yes, uh, this is the card of, uh, my friend Saritha gave us. It has the two cardinals on it, and I realize now one's a boy, one's a girl. I didn't know before. But they're sitting on a fence post on a wintry scene. Isn't that beautiful? And on the back it says, The northern cardinal is a favorite of backyard birders. birders. Its range has been increasing over the past 200 years. It can be found as far west as Manitoba and as east into the Atlantic provinces, including Newfoundland and Labrador. To learn how to attract these delightful songbirds to your backyard, visit wildaboutgardening.org. Nice. And the saying on the inside says, May the peace and beauty of this holiday season remain with you throughout the year. Much love and many blessings throughout the year. Thank you for all. Saritha, XOXO. So I gave her a great big hug and uh, told her I loved her and stuff. She sent over a box of oranges, like those peel oranges the kids love. A box of Lindor chocolates and <coughs> she gave me a couple of teacups so I wanted to show you these teacups I'm not having a cup of tea right now but I'll show you the teacups <coughs> oh boy I don't know what I did to hurt my back it just uh, it's well it's right above my right butt cheek lower back area oh, just it's okay if I'm standing straight or laying straight, but <clears throat> if I start walking around and stuff, it hurts. But look at these beauties. I said the next time I have a cup of tea, I just don't feel like tea right now. It It's hard to see on here, but on the outside it's like a peppermint green. Kind of, and this one has a little slipper, gold slipper on the bottom and a gold handle and a gold right around the top. But on the inside, you can see the flowers. See that? And here's the saucer. Beautiful. So I will be having these. I just had a cup of tea earlier, so I, I just I wasn't gonna have two two teas. Yeah. Royal Grafton Fine Bone China made in England. And that says the same thing, but then there's little permanent marker number written on there. So maybe there's just a limited amount of these coins. And she gave me another one. Oh, and this, if you can see, it looks kind of like there's little ridges around the top too, like flower petals. So beautiful. She has beautiful china and stuff over there. Oh, so, so tickled. She just said, go to the china cabinet and pick out a couple teacups. I'm like, no, I can't do that. But she is so funny and so hilarious and sharp as a whip. Like, she's just, she's such a fantastic neighbor. And not because she gave me these teacups. I'm just totally in love with her. Really, I couldn't ask for a better neighbor. There's this one. Now, I don't know if it's picking up. It's like a baby pink with gold flowers. And there's the flower on the inside. But can you see the gold flowers? And there's a gold slipper down on the bottom. And around the handle, there's like a stripe of gold. And she has gold all around the top. And this one, too. It's not like a perfect circle, there's little ridges. Beautiful. 
and there's the saucer. It's pink all around the outside and uh, all the flowers and it's lined with gold on the outside. Beautiful. This one is Bone China Claire, made in England. So yes, coming up I'll be using these teacups and I'll show you them again most likely. But yeah, this is such a short video just because I really had to lay down a lot. Um, I did do a few things uh, that I could. I didn't push myself though, but I want to use this video as um, to request questions because I wanted to do one of those question and answer videos. I'll probably do it after Christmas, like between Christmas and New Year's, and we'll sit down and have a nice tea party together. I'll, you'll have a cup of tea and I'll have a cup of tea and we'll just, I'll try to blast through the questions. So any questions you want me to answer, and I will try to answer every single one, um, so don't be shy. Uh, we'll sit down and I'll I'll print them off and I'll just we'll have a sit down tea party chit chat I did this kind of video probably a year ago so you'll know if anything's changed or for any new subscribers I've got that don't know some of the questions that I answered in my old videos this is your opportunity to ask the, those questions so go right ahead I see people have been asking me different questions while I've been doing you know doing videos but the ones that ask questions in this video down below is the ones that I'll answer because it's so hard to filter through all the I've read them all but to try to go back I'll try but you know this will be the one that I I get all the questions off of but yeah anyways I'm gonna cut it off because it is 850 and I gotta get the kids to bed uh, my husband just left to go to the gym he went in there for 830 today like this evening and it's, we're supposed to get quite a bit of snow, so I don't know. I don't know. The snow days are fun, but then I'm just like, this is the last week before school's done for a while. I wanted to try to get some stuff done, and it's hard to do when all the kids are home. So we'll see. We'll see. <clears throat> but I know the neighboring county, like Annapolis County, they were canceled today because was because of the weather and stuff, but this area wasn't canceled. So I know the kids are all hoping for a, a storm day, but yeah. Anyways, guys, uh, sorry for the short video. I really planned on trying to bake something, and I'm hoping that my back feels a bit better tomorrow. I'm not going to push myself, but I, I will. I know I'll feel a little better because I've done so much resting today. And uh, I'll take another pain medication if I need it, but I just do the rest. Rest and relax time. So, yeah, guys. So, peace, love, and happiness today and every single day. Please like, share, and subscribe if you so choose, but if not, that's okay too. I still love you. I still want all the happiness in the world for each and every one of you out there. I certainly do. I really, really do. Oh, just a second, guys. Oh, I swear to goodness. Anyways, yes. Peace, love, and happiness. And I love every single one of you. <laughs> i got to get it in there when I can. But, yeah, stop back tomorrow, please, if you want to. Oh, my battery died. Of course it did. <clears throat> Anyways, yeah, stop back tomorrow if you want to. <laughs> I'll try to, uh, if I'm feeling better, do a little more stuff around and do something Christmassy because I need to work on, if the weather's not bad, I'd like to make a trip into town uh, to get some stuff to make those craft baskets I did last year. The kids asked if we we're going to do that again this year, and I think that would be a fun activity to do on Friday, maybe, or Saturday, um, with, you know, having hot chocolate and doing some crafts and things, so... I don't know. I'm just trying to plan and map out my week. But we'll do something tomorrow for sure. So, yes, have a good night or have a good morning. And I'll see you later. Bye.